Now, that lateral movement means that you can actually screen up and down the patient over a very long distance. And so we really, and laterally quite a long way as well, and we use it in two particular situations. In nearly every case, uh, we use femoral closure devices, so we like to take an image of where the device is in the femoral artery. And by taking the C-arm out laterally, we can scan right down to the groin and get very good imaging there. The other situation in which we use it is when we're doing radial access. We do quite a lot of, radi a lot of our work via the radial uh, approach. Uh, and by taking the C-arm laterally, it means we can scan all the way down, all the way from the wrist, and obviously back up to the heart. So yes, in that situation, it's very helpful. It's really this access to the head end. Uh, and not only for the anaesthetist when we're doing PFO or ASD closures, but by the nature of our work and doing the primary angioplasties, it's not infrequent that we get patients who come who are ventilated. And in the past, when you've got your table set up and the C-arm is in the same plane as that, uh, it really means getting to the head end of the patient is very difficult uh, for the anaesthetist. And you're always having collisions between anaesthetist and tube. <laughs> Uh, and now being able to offset the device has got rid, of, got rid of an awful lot of that and makes things very easy. Two particular people who will benefit, who one, the anaesthetist. Secondly, uh, if we have a transesophageal echocardiographer in the lab, they benefit. Using the lab in general, we have both radiographers and nursing staff who actually drive the lab. Uh, we in fact only have one radiographer who oversees everybody else in the lab. Uh, so all the rest of the studies are actually run by nurses who are trained. And they find the system, once they've learnt it, is quite easy to use. There are lots of presets, so it means they're doing straightforward angiograms, there are preset positions, and the movement between those positions is very rapid and very accurate. And they, I think, find that quite easy. From a personal point of view, I find that, you know, the pedal setup is nice, you're not unbalanced by it, um, uh, and you can get a very wide range of angles. Uh, even with the biplane set up and both, uh, both tubes in. The quality of the images, I think. Uh, I find uh, the image quality is, is really very good indeed. Uh, it's a nice, brisk system. It doesn't break down. <laughs> so far, touch wood, it doesn't break down. The movement of the arm is quicker than we were used to. The storage, the digital storage system uh, works very nicely for us. Uh, we've got away from having hundreds of thousands of CDs in a room. We now have them on a digital archive. They're very quick to call up again so we can review. We don't lose studies. There's no risk of that happening. Uh, so for those reasons, and then the reasons that I mentioned before, the sort of uh, the fact that the, the system is so flexible in the angles to which you can set it, and so you can just have it in a sort of frontal plane, you can offset it up to 137 degrees, I think, and uh, that gives free access to the head end, which I've mentioned before. A particularly uh, useful feature of this system, uh, in the past when you want to uh, make sure that both your frontal and lateral uh, images are aligned, all you could do was move the table. On the lateral uh, arm of the Infinix system, you can actually move the flat plate up and down. <coughs> Excuse me, and it allows it allows you to centre without actually moving the t moving the table up and down, and that is very very helpful. On your screen, you have the coronary, so you don't have to pan a lot, and at the same time, you can get the other image, the orthogonal image, for want of a better word, uh, also centred up, uh, and so that you don't have to pan. And panning often affects in all machine in all uh, uh, screening or acquisition will affect the quality of your image. So if you can get a nice steady still image you get better quality.